Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to unroot your Samsung Galaxy Note Trinio. Now if I show you over here I have rooted my Samsung Galaxy Note Trinio as I have shown in my previous video. If you guys have not rooted your phone just for subscribe to my channel and browse through the videos uh, you will get the link how to root your Samsung Galaxy Note Trinio. Now here as you can see uh, there is a super SU file and also with root checker I have shown that yeah my device is successfully rooted. Now in this video I will show you how to unroot the device. Now suppose you want to get back your uh, the Samsung warranty and stuff like that. So you need to unroot your uh, phone and also make sure that it's, uh, it's being uh, run by its original Samsung firmware. To do the steps you need to have certain files with you. Like in the description below also I have given the download links. Primarily uh, you should have the Odin file that is necessary and this particular firmware the original firmware of uh, Samsung Galaxy Note Trinio and the triangle away root triangle away APK file. Now this is a paid app you can obviously go to the uh, Play Store Google Store and pay for this particular app but nevertheless there are, uh, in the internet there are also download links available for this so you can go ahead and download that part also and install it once you install the triangle away app it looks something like this over here as you can see it's just triangle away and that's that okay now let's get started with the process to do this process at first what I need to do is that I need to hit triangle away give it some time to load and grant the super SU access for triangle away okay no thanks now uh, over here you will see it says reset flash counter so you just need to hit that and it will give you a danger pop up and all stuff to that end of the day you have to hit continue button just hit continue and wait for some time okay has been reset okay now it's done now what I need to do is that I need to switch off the device power off and shut down okay now it's completely shut down now what I need to do is that I uh, will flash uh, my Samsung Galaxy Note Trinio with the help of Odin with this original firmware so to do the step I have to go to the download mode to go to the download mode I have to press the volume down key the home button key and the lock key button so I'm just doing those the pressing the volume down key the home button and the lock button at the same time and just continue pr pressing them till this particular screen comes now once it comes you just need to hit volume up to continue so I'm just hitting volume up okay now in my laptop uh, I'll go and open Odin just, just double click on that okay and yes and once the Odin screen comes I have to connect my phone via the USB cable to my laptop or to my PC that you're using I'm just connecting it and see once I have connected the phone and selected Odin okay now uh, everything is fine and over here see this small box turns blue this is important make sure that this box is turned blue only when Samsung keys is installed in your PC this will make sure that the box turns blue okay after that make sure that this auto reboot and the F dot reset time these two particular checkbox are checked on and after that go to PDA and navigate to the original firmware that I have shown you previously so it's very important over there that you navigate over there and yeah it, this is original firmware of course just select it everything is in place and hit start in Odin at first uh, uh, it may show you that it's not responding or stuff like that please wait see why it says not responding but nevertheless nothing to worry just keep sit tight back it will respond see the process has started you just need to give that this particular time and over here in the top left hand side bottom you will see the process is going on the system.img recovery RMG stuff is going on and also the progress bar is showing over here similarly the progress bar is appearing on your phone too so you need to do nothing else just sit back do not switch and do not touch any of the switches or stuff to that do not unplug your phone from here just sit back and relax till the process is completed it says pass over here and your phone is restarted so till the time just sit back and relax okay now it says reset over here once it says reset see your uh, no three neon device will also restart on its own but do not plug off the cable just yet just give it some time until the process is completed it will run the firmware for the first time okay the Samsung logo comes okay now it says pass so you can hit the exit over here in Odin and plug off your device and before anything else just switch off your uh, and before anything else 
just switch off your device once more and after that you need to go to the CWM of the phone too. so to go to the CWM you need to press the volume up button the home button and the lock screen button just keep on holding them okay the logo comes Samsung Note Galaxy Note 3 Neo okay here it is now here is a CWM of your phone now uh, you need to navigate using the volume up and down button and select using this power button over here so what I do I'll just go to wipe data or factory set and this is very important you need to do this step wipe the wipe the data and the factory set and hit OK over here again you just need to swipe down and select yes delete all user data and just hit that at the bottom it will show the status it says wiping data formatting data okay data wipe complete now you need to do uh, just reboot the system so hit re uh, reboot system now need to give some time because it will install the firmware for the very first time so it uh, so you need to give this particular time to your handset till the full installation process is complete and the screen comes for setup now you're quite familiar with the setup screen of a Samsung Galaxy device so just give me some time I'll go uh, I'll go and set up my device and I'll come back I'll show you that yeah, the, the device is successfully unrooted and the original firmware has been restored I may crop the video in between because you're quite aware how to set up your device right now okay guys I have set up my phone now here as you can see that there is no super SU uh, over here and also if I go to settings over here and go to general and about device here we'll see it's Android version 4.4.2 that that used to be there so I've restored back to my original Samsung Galaxy Note 3 Neo firmware and I have unrooted my device successfully that's it guys just follow the video give a thumbs up it does help the channel and please subscribe to my channel I'll come with more interesting updates very soon that's it guys bye for now